Okay, uh, welcome back to the the uh, episode. I, don't know, I think we're on episode seven now. Uh, we're building the smart booster. I know that much. I know that's where we're at. So in the last episode, things sort of fell apart, and I wanted to figure out why the hell this wasn't working. Uh, oh, by the way, by the way, before I begin, okay, I wanted to point out a couple things. First of all, we have a new texture pack, okay? Um, don't be intimidated by the texture pack. I just really like it because of the contrast between cobblestone wood and uh, track. So I just uh, I wanted to use that because I felt that it had some pretty good contrast. And this texture pack is, is kind of nice. It's pretty freaking nice if you, if you look at it. It's uh, the L texture pack, and I'll put a link to it in the description below. So, um, Okay, so we're on episode 7, and I, I told you guys in the last episode I wanted to figure out why the fuck this wasn't working at all. And uh, I did it. I figured it out. And I'm going to show you guys how to fix this. Now, um, in the beginning, uh, I thought that this booster wasn't so strict. I mean, most boosters in the game are not very strict. They're not very, um, you know, you, you can sort of modify them to your liking, and it'll be okay. There, you know, they'll work. You know, the way that they that you intend them to work. But this booster, not so much. This booster is actually really strict. I didn't realize how friggin' strict it was. You have to follow it to a T. So um, we need to we need to do some reconstruction, or well, deconstruction. So um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna break some stuff up here. The good, good bleh, bleh. the good news about this is that we're gonna actually be able to get rid of this pressure plate over here and build everything like we want it to. We will be able to put the pressure plate in the right place. So I am really happy. And by the way, it has nothing to do with orthogonal direction. It has nothing to do with the south or the west. That's well, I mean, it does. It is a little bit, but I mean, you know, it, it doesn't really matter. It, it's not dependent on the south or the west. It's dep it's, it's like, uh, it, it's dependent on the length of your track and the curves that you, that you do. I'll, I'll explain this right now. Okay, so um, I had thought I had thought we built this uh, 13 long. So um, this entire platform is actually 14 long, and I wasn't thinking about this when I when I made this three by three cube here in, on episode four, I believe it was. Um, you you need to move this cube up one. Um, the 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 five by 14. Uh, dimension is to also include the reset line. I didn't realize this. I wasn't thinking about this when uh, when I was building and showing you guys how to build the 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 extra. Uh, there's there's an extra there's extra area in the back to incorporate the reset line. So we actually need to to allow for that. And this is part of the problem. As it turns out, the length of the track needs to actually be only so long. Um, just to be very specific, in the middle you should only have, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight pieces of track in the middle. You should not have more than eight. We had nine. We only wanted eight. Okay, and then when you're building the curve at the end here, my advice to you so that you don't have to know, so because I'm not going to go figure out what direction I'm in, but uh, my advice to you is to always do your your bigger curve, this this curve that we're about to build. Always do it on the opposite uh, in the opposite orientation of this curve right here. Always do that, and then if it doesn't work, if it doesn't work, flip it to the other orientation, and then come back here and flip this curve to so instead of of it. Uh, instead of if the instead of the cart coming up and then curving to the left, have it come up and curve to the right and then curl around. So do that if you don't get it right. Of course, you can flip both heads uh, entirely, and you can um, you can mess around with that. There's a few different combinations of things that you can do to to fix this problem. But um, I I'm just gonna do this one because I already know it works. I already tried it like five minutes ago. So. Here's, here's what we're going to do. We're going to come up, we're going to build to the left and come down. And then we're going to do this. And then we're going to do our little trick here. And then, so we break this piece. Uh, we, we break this piece. Place a torch here. Put our track down. Put this piece here. And then break this torch. And I'm going to break this block. 
and then put the final piece. Perfect. Okay. And now, now if I am extremely lucky and the game likes me, then this pressure plate, this pressure plate that I'm about to place, this, this pressure plate here, um, granted I, I put it down. Where are you? There you are. Okay, then this pressure plate should work. Should work if I am correct. Let's hope to God. <laughs> okay. Okay, let's see. Yep. Okay, so that worked. Okay, cool. Okay, whoo. Oh, did not. I was, was really hoping that would work. Okay, it's still working. That's good. That's good. Because sometimes if you get close, you knock the cart a little bit to the left, and it it uh, triggers the pressure plate, even though it normally wouldn't. So the next thing that we need to do is we need to make sure our reset line is set up for this, and it's actually like almost completely re set up for this. So what we're gonna do is just break this and move it over one. That's how ridiculously stupid this is. But yeah, my advice to you is if it's not working, you need to play with it a little bit. You need to either uh, mirror or not, you know, like uh, reflect. There you go. Reflect this uh, this loop-de-loop. -loop, reflect it onto the other side of the 3x3 three three cube. And then if you do that, you have to reflect this this three by three. At least I'm pretty sure. I haven't tested I haven't tested all the permutations. So you know you got you guys got to you know try that out for me. Let me know if it works. But if it doesn't, you know you, you just keep playing around until you get it to work. But I will have you know that there is some combination of of different possibilities that will work. Okay. So then what we do? Um, I think now. Do we come up one? Yeah, we come up one more. No, actually, I don't think we do that. Okay. Uh, oh yeah, we do. I'm silly. I'm a silly man. Excuse me. I'm a silly, silly man. Okay. So that goes up and then we have one more here. And then another one here. And another one there. Cool. Oh, we're well on our way, guys. We are well on our way to amazing minecart multi-user stations. And to be honest, this is easily the mo the hardest part of this station. I'm willing I'm willing to put my money on that one. Okay. Uh okay, so now we need now because we moved everything around, we need to move this torch, right? So, let's move it a little bit to the left. And I always say left like it's always the direction that I want, but sometimes it's not. It's it's just left is so so subjective. It's such a subjective direction. Okay, let's let's put some wood here just so so I know that there's a torch. Okay. Yeah. Okay, cool. Alright. Alright. Let's oh that's not okay, cool. So now if if everything's awesome like we want it to be so Oh. Uh huh. Yeah. All right, and then we just place some redstone down here, and we should be good. Well. I think we gotta let it run for a little bit because the track's all wonky since I built the torch. It's kind of, kind of. Oh yeah, and we gotta we gotta hook up our our uh, pressure plate here. This is actually not hooked up right now, so let's do that real quick, right? Because we never actually connected it, even though we fixed it. So let's go ahead and do that. Okay. Oh, 
Okay. Yeah, I'm just I'm just so glad that we got that working. That pressure plate back there. Um, I believe, I do believe, uh, is this okay? Did it reset? I don't, I don't know. Hold on. We gotta, we gotta wait until that line turns on. That, that line down there, um, this line right here that, oh, there it goes. Okay, it didn't reset. Why didn't it reset? Did, is this... Okay, well, I'm going to watch the video and I'll figure it out. Oh, you know why? Uh, I mean, I'll, I'll, I'll play around with it. I'll figure out what, what's going on and uh, fix it. But I'll show you guys in the next episode. And then we'll, I think in the next episode, we're actually going to build the, the toggle gate. But, uh, I, you know, you guys don't actually know what that is yet. So I'm not going to try to explain it. But I'll see you guys in the next episode. Thanks for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. Have a video there. Um, I'll put the texture pack in the description. All right. Uh, have a good day.